Sims 3 Generations is arguably one of the best expansion packs ever to be released by the Sims team and in my personal opinion is the best in The Sims 3. They introduced so many different things and one of my favorite things that was introduced with this expansion was the interactive career of daycare. We are appreciating the beauty of this interactive career so I thought today I would just play a little bit and you know do a little bit of fun with this career all right. I'm very excited. I actually promoted myself because girl we just don't have the time okay I don't have the time to be sitting here and start from the beginning it's boring that way also I'm in Sunset Valley in the monotone because it is one of my favorite starter homes. I also made a little playroom for the children so I hope y'all enjoy my little decor all right I literally did not furnish any of the rest of the house because I was lazy all right I don't have the time I will say the uniforms are a hot mess okay um I, the skirt is just a no for me okay it's just a no it's just a no um it's giving me sunday school y'all remember sunday school did you ever go anybody in the comments down below go to sunday school am i the only one i went to sunday school and i had to wear like these type of skirts you know below the knees all right they can't see your kneecaps it's too much for society to see your kneecaps it brings back good childhood memories though but anyways one of the children is actually outside i also added in like a little playground if you can even call it that i just realized i have high free will on so my sim is kind of doing things how she sees fit and that's a no for me i should probably introduce you to the children this is actually the first time i'm seeing them because this is the first day of daycare but this is sandy french and we have sam here who uh needs a little bit of an outfit change just saying um but yeah he is a little cutie i'm actually okay so he's smelly so we're gonna go ahead and change his diaper. The reason that I wanted to do this career also is because I kind of feel like being challenged this evening and uh, seeing if I can really accomplish everything out of this career. I don't think, have I gotten the highest level? Yes, I have, because I have the Karams, obviously. But they haven't been doing their daycare because I have this thing where the kids just stop showing up. I don't understand what happened. They just all disappeared out of the town. Something happened. They, they, I don't know. Okay. They're just gone. So I don't know how to explain it. The children are just gone. They don't show up. Um, I just assume that all the children in the town are gone. I don't know, but, um, it's a mess. So we're giving Sam some food and how is, I don't like having one kid outside and one kid inside where it's okay. There she is. She's coming. Cause she's bored she's like i need something to do my life is just boring oh look at this old man hello i am not stressed enough for my liking and that stresses me out that i'm not stressed enough sandy is just having a ball like i don't even know what to say about her a girl is stankin'. let's go ahead and save her this is honestly a lot less interesting than i thought it was gonna be <laughs> like in my head i was like oh it's gonna be a great video people are so interested to see me do the babysitting career however um as i'm looking back at this i don't have enough children to entertain my soul okay can we like put her down outside because i'm kind of tired of being in this house it's really not a cute home so yeah let's uh sam's walking away he's like i don't wanna i don't wanna do this oh he made this little sand castle actually can we destroy it? Is that disrespectful? We're gonna destroy it. Cause I'm rude, all right. We're gonna do it, all right? We've had a long day. Yes, we need it in our soul. At least he's not here, like not out here. It's good, okay, he's not out here. Sandy is leaving, okay. I tried to put her out here. She is not having it. She was like, it is hot, okay? I do not have the time. Let's go ahead and feed her on the floor then. All right, and then you need your diaper change. That is just too much going on. These Sims are just so needy. Darlene Bunch, the icon, about to go and probably play on the playground when she should be doing her homework. It's fine. Oh my gosh, there's three kids. Okay, I have another bunch, Arlo, and then also Bella Bachelor is here too. That's crazy. That's crazy. Okay, too many children. Now this is a challenge, I, I see. Okay, what are they gonna do? Um, he's going to play on the playground. He is not going to do his homework. And look at the <laughs> Bella, of course, being the responsible one. We appreciate you, Bella. And uh, Darlene's not having it. She is doing a little sandcastle moment and she doesn't care who knows, all right? So I wish I could have brought the toddlers in the backyard. I just realized that. Sorry, guys, sorry. All right, um, I'm gonna actually maybe yeah arlo needs to stop having fun <laughs> we need to start stop having fun so we're gonna help you with your homework get off of the thingy okay thank you thank you sir we gonna help you with your homework 
Look, I am helping. Okay, when is my work day over though? Okay, it is over at seven. So I, I think Bella already finished her homework. So, girl, I'm on a roll. That's all I have to say. All right. So the kids are, <laughs> I'm glad that I added this sandcastle because now that's literally all they do. But we're going to destroy all of them as soon as they leave, just to be vicious and spiteful for no reason. Um, anyways, the kids are good. How are the little ones? Sandy French was a happy kid when I picked her up. You are amazing. What's your secret? Girl, I don't know. I just test the waters. Everybody is good. The kids were okay. No. Well, Darlene got her homework complete, which is good. Look at Sandy with the new fit. Changed her up a little bit. She's got little hearts on her jeans. It's so cute. Like, just too much. It's too cute. Look at them. Look at the little hearts. She is crawling on the ground, doing her thing, living her best life. Sam also got a nice little outfit change. Okay, looking good, Sam. Sandy, uh had a little accident so we gotta fix that i wanted to teach sam how to uh walk and stuff and he's feeling lonely which is crazy because we're teaching him stuff i meant how to talk i said how to walk it's fine it's fine but we were teaching him stuff so i don't understand but we're gonna go take care of sandy and then i guess i'll give sam some attention she picking her nose oh no 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 the children should be coming which is when things get interesting i wish i could control the children in the daycare okay i wish i could or i wish we could at least see their meter i think that'd be really cool to be able to see how they're feeling um their whole mood instead of just going based off of this one little screen i mean i know it kind of makes it more challenging but still i'm gonna put sam down sandy's in the back making a sand castle she is so <laughs> she is so cute oh my gosh okay so she's doing her thing. I mean, hey, you do what you gotta do. I forgot we never destroyed. Oh, okay. Looks like Sam's going to. All right. Well, it seems like the sand castle is like the spot to go to. I don't know. But I guess we should be out here with the children. Let's go do a little uh, sliding over here. Where is Sam? Okay. He's, he's crawling. He's like, hello. I'm ready to have some fun. Okay, now Sandy's leaving because she saw that Sam was coming over here. All right, well, let's actually destroy some sand castles. Let's destroy some sand castles. Sam is uh, having a nice time. Great. Let's zoom in and see me destroy this sand castle. Come on, girl. We don't have all day. Let's go. <gasps> all right. Oh, oh, right in front of the children. <laughs> Uh, she's having enjoying this a little too much. I don't know if I should be concerned or, and I mean, okay. <laughs> it brings us a little bit of joy, which is great. Um, cause she's feeling great, but she's losing hygiene, which is interesting. I'm reading with Sandy and she seems to be having a fantastic time and it's just making my soul happy. I realized the last time that we had the children over, we didn't even feed them. So that's probably why our thing was not that great but look how cute i hope sandy's learning something because i really need our performance to be great and where are the other children shouldn't they be here by now or i think they come at four maybe i'm speeding through this because like who cares are they coming why are the children not here oh there they are okay hey girl hey darlene how you doing i feel like four to three seven is not enough time to get all the sims like the child sims taken care of which is crazy you would think that it would but okay so she's lonely so we're gonna help her with her homework we were doing pretty good on the book but we can finish it tomorrow okay no big deal sandy have a good time doing something else we could put her in a walker but you know what we don't have the time we gotta make sure the kids are taken care of where is darlene she <laughs> All these kids with the sand castle. It's just too much. It's just too much. And look, Sam is in the sand castle. She was like, I'm doing my homework in the sand castle. I don't even care what you say. And of course, Bella is going. If Bella goes to the sand castle and look, sand. <laughs> the sand castle. It's, it's what gets them. It really is. I just realized I've been calling it a sand castle and it's a sandbox. Anyways, they're having a great time. We're ha we can have all of our children in one space. It looks like Arlo's coming out here as well. This was a very 
smart purchase. If anybody has a daycare, it seems like the kids really gravitate towards the sandbox, um, especially if you have the toddler mod for this. Um, if you have that, they'll gravitate towards the sandbox, it seems like. So definitely add a sandbox in your daycare and see how it effects. I'm gonna order some food for the children because I just realized that uh, I didn't cook anything for them to eat. So we're gonna have to order something. I don't really know what I want to order but chicken sounds like a good idea so i think we're gonna order deep fried no maybe we should do something healthy i'm actually gonna go with spaghetti with veggie sauce i feel like that's a good combo up oh, here is the woman with the takeout yes we can save it for tomorrow i went ahead and promoted myself yes beautiful this is the daycare van we take care of six kids and we also have to take care of after school kids and you know the occasional difficult child who will ruin stuff the thing about the last level is that you'll get some kids who will literally like destroy your appliances or like you know pull pranks and stuff you have to be like no do not do that Oh my gosh, it's a deer. We have a new kiddo named Irma. Look how cute she is. Her little outfit, her little bottle. She just killing it, her pigtails, adorable. Okay, so we're taking care of Sandy. I'm about to put her in the um, walker so that she can learn how to walk. Hopefully we will be able to complete that today. I don't really know. We probably should finish the book we were reading with her, but it's fine. I'm reading the book to Sam because he needed a little bit of attention. So they're having a nice time. Look at them, adorable. Back to destroying sand castles in my heels. Yes, all the kids are still playing in. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they're still playing. We need to put out the spaghetti for the children when they arrive so they can have something to eat. So I'm going to go ahead and just put out the leftovers. Good thing that they're not nasty. I mean, you know, with that fridge quality, I would not be surprised. The kids are eating spaghetti and everybody seems to be doing pretty decently, which is quite shocking, to be honest. Um, I don't really know. Okay, yeah, Bella's in a good mood. Darlene's in a good mood. Arlo's in a... Eh. He's eh, but it's fine. He's doing his homework, so that's really all we need him to do. We're going to go ahead and toss um, Sam in the air because his mood's going south, so I just want to try and, like, get him in as good as a mood as possible. So we have to put him in the walker and everything. Bella! Okay, she's going to go swimming. What are you doing? Irma's lonely. Well, it's because you're all the way back here. How do you expect to have a little fun if you're in here? Okay, I'm going to bring Irma back inside. Hopefully, um, Sam does a little bit with this walker. I don't really know. Um, but the daycare day is almost over, which kind of stinks. That's what I'm saying. It's like it's so hard to do anything with the children. You can't even help all of them with their homework because there's not enough time. So there's a gym over here. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, y'all. I did horrible. All of their homeworks were incomplete, which is just tragic. Just a tragic, tragic work day. I honestly just thought it would be kind of like a fun video to go back into the babysitting career and just kind of see how challenging it is because one of the things that I'm really interested in doing is a seven toddler challenge in The Sims 3. I feel like that is going to be absolutely just a mess but i don't know i'm looking forward to it so that's why i wanted to do a video like this if you guys would like me to do just like more random like spontaneous kind of weird like i don't know videos in the sims 3 let me know in the comments down below i'm ending the video bye guys